This math knowledge practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCAT says, what is an equation of the graph shown? So in other words, we have to use this graph to write an equation of a line. And of course, you should know that the most common equation for a line is slope-intercept form, that is y equals mx plus b, where m is the slope and b is the y-intercept. Let's talk about the slope for a minute, that is m. We can see that as we go from left to right, this line decreases. So that means our slope is going to be negative. So let's look through our answer choices. Uh, the slope in A is negative 2, so that's a negative slope. This is a possible answer choice. The slope in B is x, that's positive 1. This cannot be an answer choice. We have a negative slope here. Uh, the slope in C is negative 1. You can see that there's a negative in front of the x, so this is a possible answer choice. And the slope in D is 2. Uh, that's positive, so this is not a possible answer choice. Now let's talk about the y-intercept, that is B. B is the point at which this line intersects the y-axis here. And it may be hard to see, but it does that right at negative 8. So we know B in this case is negative 8. All right, so the only other thing we need to write this equation of our line is our slope. And we can calculate that very quickly by saying, uh, m slope is equal to y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. Where do we get the values x1, y1, x2, y2 from? We get those values from any two points on this line. So right here is the point negative 8, 0. I'm going to let that be x1, y1. And right here at our y-intercept is the point 0, negative 8. I'm going to let that be x2, y2. So let's just plug those values in and get our slope. Again, y2 is negative 8, so this is negative 8, minus y1, that's 0, over x2. x2 is right here at 0, minus uh, x1. It's right here, it's negative 8. All right, let's solve this. Uh, negative 8 minus 0 is negative 8. 0 minus negative 8, a negative uh, minus a negative becomes a positive. So 0 minus negative 8 becomes... 0 plus 8, or just positive 8. Again, a negative divided by a positive is going to be a negative. Specifically, negative 8 divided by 8 is negative 1. So we know our slope is negative 1. So this is negative 1x minus 8. Again, in algebra, you don't write that 1 in front of x. So this is negative x minus 8. And we can see that that is, in fact, answer choice C in this case.